Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday morning. It's a little cloudy outside, but hopefully the sun will come out at some point today. I don't think it's going to, but we're going to go ahead and get started with some stretching. So if you have anything today that's a little bit tight, feel free to drop that in the chat box and I'll add that in. Um, our main focus today is going to be the upper body. So we're going to start with some neck stretches and then we're going to move into some chest and upper back stretches. So we're going to get the upper body nice and warmed up. Um, so I'll go ahead and get started with that. But if you feel free to drop anything in the chat at any time. And we're going to start off today with um, some neck stretches. So I'm going to start with my right hand. I'm going to place my right hand in the middle of my back in between my shoulder blades here. And I'm going to bring my left ear to my left shoulder. So just going down to the side here. And then I'm going to take my left hand and place it on top of my head and let that arm rest here. And we're going to get a nice stretch through the side of the neck. I want to make sure our back is nice and flat, core is tight, standing up nice and tall. And exhaling any tension we feel in the neck. And on our next exhale, we're gonna go ahead and now and bring our chin down towards our chest, looking towards the ground. Hand is still on top of the head. We're not pulling our head down. We're just letting it rest there, getting a nice stretch now in the back of our neck and into the traps a little bit here. I know mine are already tight from just working for the last few hours, so. Definitely feels good to stretch that out. And let's go ahead and do one more big inhale here. And we're gonna slowly exhale. And we could gently bring our head back to center. Let our hands fall to the sides. We can shake it out a little bit and then my shoulder gets tight in that position. And we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So I'm gonna take my left hand placing it in between my shoulder blades here and bringing the right ear to the right shoulder, taking our right hand, placing it on top of our head. So again, getting a nice little stretch in the side of our neck. Still making sure we're standing up nice and tall. Core is tight, back is flat. And on our next exhale, we can go ahead and bring our gaze back to the ground, chin towards the chest, and same thing, hand on top of the head, letting it rest there, helping gravity do its thing. Feeling that stretch more now in the back of our neck and into our traps a little bit. And let's go ahead and do one more big inhale here. And we're gonna slowly exhale. And again, gently let that head come back to center, dropping those hands to our sides. And again, shaking that on out. All right, the next thing we're gonna do is something different. Um, it's similar to that stretch that we've done in this class before where we had our hands over our head but we're gonna need a wall for this. So find some space on a wall or a door, something that's closed and sturdy and can hold your weight. And we're gonna stand with our hands above our head very slightly. And we're gonna walk our, hand, our hands, our feet out away from the wall a little bit, keeping our back nice and flat. We're just gonna let that head kind of dip under our arms here. So this stretch is gonna, we're gonna start to feel that stretch through the shoulders through the lats, through the back. We're taking nice big deep breaths into our chest, really feeling our lats open up, really those back at the back of our armpits really are gonna be opening up here. We're gonna get a slight stretch through the neck here as well. So we're inhaling nice and deep. 
exhaling, feeling that stretch get deeper and deeper. Making sure we're not letting our back arch too much. And let's go ahead and do one more big inhale here. And slowly exhale. We can gently come back up to a standing position and we can walk our hands back. And the next thing we're gonna do is still on the wall. So stay near the wall that we're using and we're gonna do a nice chest stretch. So I'm gonna start with my left arm. I'm gonna have my left foot in front and I'm gonna reach my right, my right, my left arm back towards that wall. And we're gonna try and open up our chest by rotating a little bit more away from the wall. So we should start to feel this stretch through the front of the shoulders, through the chest. And that's gonna help us counteract that movement of, uh, by movement, I mean the position when we're sitting at our desks or sitting at our desks the majority of the day. So it's gonna help offset that. Make us a nice chest stretch here. And let's go ahead and do one more big inhale. And on the exhale, we can gently come out of that stretch. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So I do not have a wall on the other side. So I apologize, I'm gonna to have to face the other way. But same thing, so now I'm using my right leg is gonna be next to the wall, left leg is gonna be open, reaching back behind us with the right arm. And then we're gonna open up twisting away from the wall. So we wanna make sure we're not going too far where we start to feel some pain. We just want a nice stretch through the front of our chest and through the shoulders a little bit. Still inhaling nice and deep into that chest, really feeling to open up. And let's go ahead and do one more big inhale. And we're gonna slowly exhale, gently turning back towards the wall and letting those hands fall back down to the sides. Wonderful. All right, last thing we're gonna do here is we're gonna make our way to the ground onto our hands and our knees. And I know yesterday we did an active version of this stretch with Luis, but today we're gonna do just a stretch doing thread the needle here. So we're on the hands and knees. And I'm gonna start with my right arm. I'm gonna take my right arm, thread it in between my left arm and my left leg, placing the back of the hand on the ground, palm up, head is on the ground. We are pushing that hand into the ground and pulling away with our upper back. So that's gonna give us a nice stretch right under that shoulder blade. Again, counteracting that position that we are in the majority of the day. Starting off, starting off our morning, stretching out our upper body before we go back to our desks. Sighing out any tension we feel in our back today. And let's go ahead and do one more big inhale. And we'll slowly exhale. And we'll make our way back onto our hands and our knees. Then we'll do the same thing on the other side. So now I'm gonna take my left arm and I'm gonna thread it in between my right arm and my right leg, pressing the back of my hand into the ground and pulling away with that upper body. So again, feeling that stretch in the traps right under the shoulder blades as well. Getting a nice upper back stretch here. Breathing nice and deep into our chest, feeling that back expand with each inhale. And we're gonna do one more big inhale here. And slowly exhale. We can replace that hand and return to our hands and our knees. 
And that's going to be all I have time for today. So you can return to a seated kneeling or standing, however you would like to end this stretch break. But thank you all so much for coming. I hope you feel nice and stretched out. Our upper bodies are feeling nice and refreshed. Um, we do have one more stretch break today at 2.30. So don't miss out on that. And we have um abs and core with Luis today at 4 30 and don't forget we are having a design to run training program so we're going to help you prepare for the design to run race happening in may so sign up for that by scheduling a consult with either myself Luis, or Brittany, um and do that in between february 22nd and march 5th so really excited about that you can check out anything else we have going on on our sharepoint site and hope everyone has a great rest of their morning and I will see you all later.